Hey guys, what's up? My name is Sabargo. And for this week's video, I thought that I would do a Snapchat Q&A session. Fun, cool, Q&A. Yeah, questions. So, I asked you guys on Snapchat to send me questions, and I'm gonna answer them right now. If you don't have me on Snapchat, add me right now. It's Sabargo, S-E-B-B-A-R-G. Go do it right now, and let's get to it. Before I start, I wanted to tell you guys that I am going to PrideCon with Diongo. That's like a convention for LGBTQ people. So if you want to go, make sure you check the links below. I will put them there, there, and go check it out. Pride Gun is cool. <clears throat> oh my god, I just took a selfie. Oh my gosh. <laughs> now, gracias. Hey, Sebastian. Big fan over here. My question would be, <clears throat> dude, how much do you miss D on like a daily basis? He asked how much do I miss Dion on a daily basis, and it's definitely gotten easier, but at the end, I, like, I, I miss him a lot, but at the beginning I would be like, ah, oh, I miss him, and right now I'm like, ah, oh, I miss him, but I'm gonna see him soon. So yeah, that's better, like... When did you know that you were gay? Yes, I love you so much. Oh, I love you too. Anyway, she asked when did I know that I was gay or bisexual or whatever. I'm bisexual. Guess you can like always know, but like society makes you like block it, you know? So like in my opinion, I think that I always kind of like had a thing for guys and girls, but I never really knew that it could be a thing. So I was like, no, that's wrong. I only like girls. And then all of a sudden I was like, you know what? Whatever. Bam. Come everyone. Kiss me right now. That's, that's how I see it. Can you say something in Spanish? I love you so much. I love you too, and te amo, that's something in Spanish, and you should, you guys should show me your faces, because you guys are beautiful, okay? Don't ever cover your faces. What is one memorable moment that you and Dion have that just, you wish you could do all over again? Thank you, love you. I think that the most memorable moment I have with Dion is, well, like, I really like when we went to Washington for Playlist DC. Cause it was like we were just getting to know each other, it was like exciting and I think it was really fun. Like I would totally do it again over and over and over and over and over again. It was great. <laughs> your parents reacted when you told them that you're gay. And I love your videos, I'm from the Netherlands, but yeah, I hope we will meet one day. Yay, yeah, me too. Thank you for loving them, I love you. And my parents' reactions when I told them that I was bi, they were like, at first they were like, oh no, what is this? What is this new world you opened to us? And then my mom was like, oh no, there's no such thing as bisexuals. And then my dad was like, oh no. Yeah, like they were, they freaked out a lot. <laughs> that was a good dramatization step. I was wondering if you love One Direction and if you do, who is your favorite? I do love One Direction, and my favorite would probably be, I'm, I have a, this thing in between Louis or Liam, I don't know which one, or Niall, or Harry. Zane when he used to be in One Direction, either or. So all of them. Uh, Hi. What is your favorite movie? My favorite movie, that's yeah. so hard. I don't think I have one, I have like a million. I love White Chicks, I love Mean Girls, I love The Amazing Spider-Man, I love Jurassic World, I love all of the Jurassic Park movies, TBH. I love uh, Stuck in Love, I love that movie too. I like all movies, so all of them. Hey, so my question for you is what's your favorite country? My favorite country, that's hard. I have a thing for France, cause like, I think it's really cool. But honestly, I just love all countries. I wanna travel everywhere before I die. So, the world is my favorite country. Hi Sam, my name's Gio. I just wanted to ask, if you woke up in the morning and you were somebody else, who would you be and why? Love you too. And if I woke up and I was somebody else for like a day or something, I would probably be Taylor Swift because she's amazing. I'm just kidding. Well, like maybe I would like to be Taylor Swift for a day because like to see what, what it's like to be amazing. But also I would probably be her cat because I would love to be her cat and then she could like take me everywhere. I could also be like someone cool like Obama. I don't know. <laughs> Ooh, I love you. I love the feeling you've got going on. <laughs> My favorite song at the moment would probably, like apart from Taylor Swift, because I think I made clear that I love her, probably Love Myself by Hayley Steinfeld or Sorry by Justin Bieber. It's just songs that make me like want to dance in the club, you know? Anyways, those are all the questions that I'm going to answer today. If you like this video, make sure you give the video a thumbs up and comment down below any other questions you might have and I will be answering them right now. Make sure you go check out the links below for the pride gun thing and for all my my social links and I love you guys. Thanks for watching, like, share, and subscribe. I love you guys. Bye! That was Spanish. Uh, and he asked me if my name was Matilda. 
But it's not Matilda. I have known it 